Depending on where you live in the world, there are a lot of rappers or there are a small amount of rappers. So where there are a small amount of rappers, it's easier to build a buzz. But where there's a lot of people, you have to come above the rest and really be heard. And that's why they call it a buzz because there's like, I right, there's, a, there's a noise being made somewhere in the world and this person needs to be noticed. And the way you do that is by building a following. Some people build a following just by sharing music. At the end of the day, it's the music business, so it's about the music. So by just creating music and putting it out there as a mixtape, as a music video on YouTube, as a downloadable song on, uh, on the various platforms online, such as SoundCloud or going through TuneCore, going straight to iTunes, however you do it, you have to get the music out there. And by getting the music out there, then people start to hear you and like you. And in addition to putting the music out there, you want to build your numbers on social media, Twitter, Facebook, Reverb Nation. Let people follow you, get into you, and that is one way that you could build a buzz. And the third way to build a buzz is trying to open up for known artists because people are going to come to the show to see Rick Ross, to see, you know, Meek Mills. And by coming to see those artists, then they discover you and by performing, by sharing music, by building your name on social media, that is the way that you build a buzz. And from getting that buzz, you can go on and get a record deal or go on to be a star. Music